Recently we asked through an email our customers uh, how we could help them with their business and again marketing materials seem to be a very popular response. Uh, so I want to give you some good news. We actually did update and included new marketing materials for you. These are downloadable customizable. You can either have them printed at a, a professional printer near you or you can actually run them off your own office printer. And today I wanted to give you a demonstration of how you can customize these. We've actually removed most of the Techstone branding on this. You're able to put in your own logos now, you're able to put in photographs, change images, everything. It's great and I wanted to do a demo to show you how to do this. First, I'd like to uh, show you uh, at least one of the editing programs. You're going to have to get a PDF editor there are editors that are free. Some of them do cost. I would say for the uh, luxury of being able to do this, it's probably about $70, $80. I'm not sure. The Wondershare is the one I'm going to demonstrate. But again, some of these other ones should be able to do this for you. Just download this. I think they give you a free trial as well. I already have this on my machine. So what I'm going to do is show you one of the new bro the, uh, brochures that we actually added. We offered these before. We're now offering them a lot of different colors. That's what's kind of new about those and also the ability to put your logos on it. But this is a brand new one. This brochure is actually great for funeral homes or for retailers who cater to funeral homes. This is something you can put into an aftercare package and it's a really great, very subtle uh, indication that you know, you're know you the resource to go to when they are ready for their, for their headstone. So we'll just go to brochures and as you can see here we have both single and companion headstones and then we have these options here. And you can see we can just, let's say we're going to go to the dark blue, it's going to pull it up and it'll show you exactly what it's like. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and uh, shut this down and I'm going to edit one for you. So this is the Wondershare PDF element. Um, I actually use Adobe but I brought this in so you could see how you could do it on your end. And then I brought up the, uh, the blue flyer here. What's interesting about this is we currently already have this as in a, f a form field. Let me show you that. So when you go to this, and if you're going to type in the name of the uh, person, let's say it's Reynolds, you hit enter, and it pre-fills in all the other ones. Pre-fills it in. One thing you'll notice is that there actually isn't uh, enough room to actually put the uh, passing date on these. We would actually have to reduce this font so small in order to do that, that we assume just for the uh, purpose of demonstration to the family that if you could just keep both the, the birth dates, that that would be enough for them to understand what you were going for. So getting back to the Wondershare PDF editor, this is what you can do. Again, this is going to be your company. So what you would want to do is you can go in here. If you go up here, you can edit text, edit objects. We're going to edit objects right now. And you can just click on that. And as you can see, highlight it, and you can delete it. Uh, you can put your logo in. So what we're going to do is we're going to want to add a picture. We're going to add an image. And I'll just navigate here. The image is brought in. And then you can manipulate the image as well. We're going to reduce the size of this. You're going to want your logos without the white backgrounds. And so that file format is usually called a PNG or also a GIF, J -I, I'm sorry, G-I-F. As you can see, you can just put your logo in there. Manipulate it that way. Come over here. You can either get rid of this. We're going to go back to Edit Objects. And you can either delete this and just leave this blank, or you can add your own image. We're going to add our own image here. going to edit text. And 
we highlight the box. We can come up here. And then we can move the box as well. This box here is a great place for you to add a message. We go up here, add text. And there you have it. Basically, all you have to do now is save this. Go to File, Go, and Save As. And you browse and put it wherever you'd want it. So that is basically how you edit these documents, modify them, change them, add your logos, add your names, uh, add pictures. You can change photos on some of them. Uh, really customize these marketing materials for your own benefit. You'll have your list of downloadables here. Uh, for instance, on trifolds, we have two different options. We have the ones that just say download, and then we have a printer version. The printer version are the ones that you would use if you're going to take these to a professional printer in your area and get them done. And you can see they'll have the color bars and the crop lines and so forth. But we hope that helps. Uh, anything we can do to help you, feel free to write us an email and share with us uh, other marketing materials we might be able to produce for you. Thank you.